sense. And next speaker is Mr. Stadler for one minute. Uh, President. Thank you, President. I'd like to come back to this argument between Mr. Sister and Mr. Holmeyer. Of course, if you remove borders, that is in the interest of citizens, but it is also within the interests of organized crime. These two things are true. And I think the Commissioner has got an enormous amount of work to do because the European Union, where it has competence, where it can actually deal, where it should actually do something, if you look at the sums of money uh, Mr. Iacolino mentioned and, and, and human suffering which he described, I don't think I need to reiterate this. I think we have all of these figures in this report. But all of this really implies that the European Union needs to prove that where the Union is responsible, where they have competences, they should really do uh, something. They should introduce the necessary uh, steps because I'm sure that uh, cr com criminal organizations in, in, in Europe uh, have an uh, enormous amount of um, areas to work. Now let us look at uh, uh, Turkey. Uh, a lot of the uh, criminal organizations in Austria and in the Federal Republic of Germany are Turkish organizations, so we cannot possibly deal with a Turkish entry until that has been settled.